Good morning, I'm in my gym parking space and I actually wanted to be here at 7 today, like 7 a.m. And now it is 7.44. <laughs> so that didn't work out. I, I wanted to get up at like 5.30. The reason why I wanted to be here so early today is because today I'm going for a breakfast with my mom. I uh, make her like a voucher once a year, either for Christmas or her birthday, where I invite her for a breakfast and she can choose the location. And um, where I live, they're actually open like a new restaurant, like an Italian restaurant kind of like, and they also have breakfast, looks really, really good. And we want to try that today. So, and because obviously we don't want to um, eat breakfast at like 11 or 12, I wanted to make sure that I am done at the gym very early also. But we go at 10. So I kind of also miscalculated everything. I don't know why I had the urge to be here at 7. <laughs> but I'm, I'm late anyways. And I should really go inside. And um, I'm doing a pool day today. I'm not gonna film it because um, in my last two videos I showed you my pool day, so if you want to see that. Um, but I'm gonna film my quad day tomorrow because I haven't filmed that in so long. I always film like when I do hamstrings and pool day. I don't know why they are just the days usually where I film my videos, so... motivated today to work out it was really one of these days where i just didn't want to do it and when i worked out it was like you know when you can't do your usual weights and like your usual weights just feel so much heavier <laughs> yeah that was the day today i also had like the worst i don't know stomach cramp bloating in the morning when i woke up i have no idea from what it just randomly came and i was like i don't know if i can even train but I still went and I wanted to try and it got better. Um, thankfully, it is almost gone. I started my workout with doing squats. I always warm up with um, just the barbell. Um, I didn't film that, but I always like to do a warm-up set just with the barbell. And then I do a lighter weight and then I just up my weight throughout the set. Sometimes I also like when I take a heavy weight, I don't do as many reps or I don't go as deep but i still like to do it because i can really feel the burn and long story short i then did walking lunges i hate walking lunges i hate single leg exercises they're like the worst the worst and then i did like leg press in a superset with the goblet squat which is just at this point you just start questioning your entire life <laughs> I love the leg press though, I love the leg press, I just, this, this super set is just so, like, it burns, it hurts, it is, but it is, it is good, it is good. And then I, I finished it off with some cable kickbacks, I haven't done cable kickbacks in months and months and months, and I recently started doing them again, and now I remember why I didn't like to do them, I don't know why, but I always get, like, lower back pain from cable kickbacks, <gasps> probably because I'm doing them wrong, but yeah, I just don't wanna, don't wanna do them anymore, <laughs> because I always have lower back pain. I have I have my protein shake. I still have strawberry. I tried strawberry for the first time. I wanted to have like a summer flavor. I cannot wait for strawberry to be empty again. I mean, I like it, but I miss my chocolate shake after my workout. And I also brought some... <laughs> I brought some rice waffles um, because I have some errands to run and until I'm home 
like the time between my workout and the time where I come home is like too long without any food. So I just wanted to, I just wanted to have something very I just wanted to have something very quick to snack on. So I'm gonna have a little rice bowl. Everything's going wrong. I have to pick up a few things from the drugstore because next week actually I'm gonna be on a trip for four days. I'm going to Barcelona with a friend. I'm so excited to go there. I haven't been on a vacation in ages. So I want to get some contact lenses. Like I don't know what they're called, but the ones you just throw away after you use them for one day. Because I don't want to be bothering with cleaning them when I'm away, when I'm on a trip. And sometimes I'm tired or when I go to a club. I don't go to clubs. <laughs> but if I'm tired and I have a long night or something, I don't know. I hate like when I know I have to clean my contact lenses afterwards and probably pick up some Starbucks. I do not live in the US and I've been complaining for two years that we don't have a pumpkin cold brew here. Only pumpkin spice latte or iced pumpkin spice latte. But I'm a big fan of cold brew. And I was so, so sad that we don't have the pumpkin cold brew. And now, two years later, finally have it and I haven't tried it. So I, I'm gonna pick it up later. I really want to try the pumpkin cold brew so bad. I also have to um, clean my car. I'm gonna go to my mom. We're gonna clean my car because it is, it's never been worse. Um, Every time when I'm running errands during the week and there's so many cars and so many people, I'm always like, what are you all doing? <laughs> Why do you not work? I mean, I'm a student. I know that I have off, but what are all the other people doing? You know what I mean? Um, oh my gosh, the lighting is terrible. I have my, what is it called? I have my pumpkin cream cold brew. So what is it called? Does it look amazing? Does it look amazing? I've never had this, so we're gonna do a first. We're gonna do a first impression. <laughs> um, we're not doing a makeup tutorial. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. And <gasps> wow, it looks, it looks amazing. It smells like pumpkin spice latte. What did I put on it? Like, I know it's cinnamon. I mean, it's supposed to be cinnamon, right? I don't know. It just tastes. It just smells like fall. Every time someone asks me, "What does a pumpkin spice latte taste like?" I'm always like, "It tastes like fall in a mug." <laughs> Mm. Love it. Love it. But I do think I prefer the pumpkin spice latte iced. They also have like, what was it called? Like a salted maple caramel latte or something like that. I also want to try that one. I also want to try that one. But I have to say I do prefer the iced pumpkin spice latte a bit. You know what this reminds me of? A video I did like two years ago when it was like super hot and I got my first pumpkin spice latte and then I decorated for um, fall. How fast the times pass. A quick random little haul. Um, please, oh, <laughs> the mess in the background. Oh, I'm just gonna ignore that. Um, very random things that I bought. I bought myself hair dye because I wanna dye my hair before I go on vacation. They only had one package left. I need two packages to dye my hair because I have very long hair. Um, I need to check if I have a second one at home, otherwise I will have to pick up another one. Bought some chapstick, I always buy the same. Protein bar, although I had a protein bar in my car, I bought two because I wanted to try them. I don't like the, I don't like the texture, I don't like the taste of the other one. The other one was like vanilla, coconut. I don't know which protein bars are good, like the best ones I've ever had are from Women's Best, but I need to find maybe an alternative or, you know, one that I can buy at the store. Long story short, I bought white nail polish. Mine's always chipped, always, always after one day of painting them and it upsets me. I need to find another solution because this is just, this is boring me. I'm thinking of maybe uh, press on nails, but they're pretty expensive. Like the cheapest option is nail polish. I have to paint them like two to three times a week and it is just exhausting. <laughs> so yeah, I bought a deodorant because I needed one. And I also bought a body lotion because mine is pretty big and is a little bit smaller to travel with. So, and then I got these. <laughs> they're like fitness cereal cornflakes. 
I usually don't buy stuff like this because once it says fitness or something, you know, it is bullshit <laughs> um, and it probably isn't healthy anyways, but, 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 but my gym bestie, um, who I always, always, who I sometimes go to the gym together with, <laughs> she has these, she snacks on them after her workout and I tried them and they taste amazing, like amazing, um, just as a snack, but also with milk, I just... Just imagining this with a little bit of milk. Love it, love it. 